MIT has really been the crux of the, or the, the epicenter of the photonic technology. Um, even before I came here, Professor Ippen's work, Car Franz Kartner and uh, uh, Lionel Kimmerling sort of started, uh, uh, Hermann House even uh, uh, in the late 90s, started this whole effort of silicon photonics devices. And what my group brought to that is a systems view. Okay, let's try to uh, bring this into the mainstream uh, productions where you can actually build and print thousands of these devices at once and see how they interact and how are they, make them compatible to these processes. And then Rajiv Ram also, uh, uh, together with me, joined and we developed this whole technology. And now as an offspring of that, uh, Milos Popovic is now at UC Bowl, uh, at Boulder, Colorado, also collaborating with us. But everything sort of originated from MIT and with MIT people. Working at MIT with, uh, uh, on, on these projects that are essentially extremely complex. We're talking about process, understanding of processes of modern technologies all the way up to the architecture and systems has been extremely uh, useful in, in the MIT environment. The reason is that um, such complex processes require a lot of collaboration between different groups. No single group at MIT, for example, would have all the expertise to span across all the layers. But what we've managed to do is build an ecosystem of research groups at MIT that very nicely work together in achieving these bigger goals. And um, there's a number of examples, most, most are sort of in this photonics integration area. A um, number of different projects and collaborations that involve people in material science department like Kimmerling, Rajiv Ram, and um, RLE, Mike Watts, CSAIL people like Anand Agarwal, uh, Lee Schwampe, they're on the architecture side, even outside people like Chris uh, uh, in Berkeley, where we've built these ecosystems that plug into the system framework and enable us to deliver really well in these very complex uh, projects. So MIT, uh, as an co extremely collaborative environment, has really helped there a lot.